In the last hour, the family of William Deasy has issued a statement clarifying the circumstances of his death. The 32-year-old from Cork was killed in Mozambique while working on a construction project for Kent's engineering. His family says he was the victim of a serious assault and was not shot dead, as had been previously reported. Now let's take a look at some other headlines from here at home. A man and a woman found shot dead in a B&B in Carlo have been identified, but their names won't be officially released until post-mortems are finished. It's believed the couple in their 50s have been socialising in pubs around Carlo town before their deaths. Both sustained gunshot wounds, but Gardaí are not looking for anyone else in connection with the investigation. More than 100 people have had to be rescued from impassable mountain roads in County Wicklow in just 48 hours. Snow and ice have made the Sally Gap extremely treacherous and motorists continue to get stranded. Rescue teams have responded to eight incidents in five days, many of them families with young children. Even four-wheel drive vehicles are struggling on the icy roads, with many cars being simply abandoned by their owners. And there was a lucky escape for school children in County Down today. A school bus carrying 13 children with special needs overturned this morning after it collided with a van near Downpatrick. The children were all strapped into harnesses and were not seriously hurt. Police say the driver was shaken by the crash.